hype up the nice killing Akuyilis. The stanza from senseless murderers in southeast. The indigenous people of Biafra on Wednesday distanced themselves from the senseless killings in the southeast geopolitical zone of the country. This is as the group claimed that the senseless killings were politically motivated, stating that masterminds were taking advantage of the current situation in the region to unleash mayhem on their political opponents. The group also noted that it did not at any point issue a statement on the forthcoming governorship election in Anambra State to the effect that the election will not hold. The director of media and publicity of the secessionist group, Ima Powerful, I had the group's view in a statement on Wednesday, which was made available to the punch. The statement read in part, We, the great family of the indigenous people of Biafra, ably led by our great leader, Mazi Namdi Kano, Ochuku Kano, uh, wish to disassociate ourselves from the senseless killing of innocent citizens in Anambra State. We have no hands in the political killings going on in Biafra land. We have at several times raised the alarm that some cruel politicians are hiding under the clerk of the situation in Biafra land to eliminate their political enemies and blame it on IPOP. We also wish to clarify that IPOP has never issued an official statement that there would be no governorship election in Anambra State. Those peddling such rumor are not our members and should be ignored. Our position on the Anambra election will be made public at the right time through our normal channels of information, this dissemination. Anything to the contrary should be disregarded. I pub further claim that those who killed Professor Dora Kuyelis were responsible for the death of her husband. Those who killed Dora Kuyelis' husband killed his wife with poison because she exposed the death of Yaradua for good luck. Ebele Jonathan to take over as president of Nigeria. They know themselves they conspired to poison Professor Dora Akwili. Indeed, we have no issues with Chike Akwili and we don't know him. Those behind those acts must stop this and stop using IPOP name. We don't want anybody to blame IPOP because we must get them. This is purely a political assassination going on in Anambra State. It is obvious that those that burned Anambra government house and other part of the state some years back are back to use intimidation and killing to subdue their opponents ahead of the governorship election in Anambra state. Hmm. If you ask me this is good. It's good that they came out early to speak or else people will continue to use bad eyes to look at them and think that they are bad people. Or well, you can go to the comment section and share your take on this article. Thanks for listening.